the magic of Vienna, a city that has been the center of musical excellence for well over 100 years, maybe 150 years. The home of Mozart, Beethoven, Brahms, uh, Suppe, Schubert, and of course, the Strauss family. The music of Johann Strauss has become the theme for the ever popular New Year's concerts that are played in, uh, in Music Verein in Vienna by the Vienna Philharmonic Orchestra. They've been doing this since the, I think they've been, they did it since the 1800s and there was a few years off during the war years and now it's been uh, every year. It's, they're fabulous. We established this, this uh, idea of doing it and realized that uh, you don't, we don't have to play Strauss waltzes and polkas and marches all the time. There's always that lovely spirited Viennese music on the program, but there are other things because these other composers that live there um, in Vienna, uh, that's also Viennese music of a sort. So. Um, this year, there's uh, some great overtures. There's one by uh, Franz von Suppe, and it's, uh, I think it's Light Cavalry this year. It's a fabulous overture. It's uh, lots of trumpets, and drums, and what have you. Uh, we're also having a couple of singers. Um, Andrew Greenwood, a baritone, and Labrula Papas, who is a soprano, and they're going to be doing some excerpts from operas and some Viennese. So they'll be doing things from um, The Merry Widow uh, by Franz Lehar. And these are tunes and melodies that people know. I mean, they're fairly, fairly common uh, to be performed. Uh, but there's a couple other opera excerpts also. The thing about opera singers is that they have these highly trained voices, but they also, nowadays, have to be actors. So if they're standing in front of the orchestra singing, they're actually acting. And our, our theater is fairly small, so you can actually get a look at their faces and everything they're doing. And uh, it's not really heavy stuff they're singing. They're, they're just beautiful pieces of music. So you can appreciate them on many levels. You can enjoy them for their melodic content or for the acting that they're doing or for the emotional appeal. You don't have to know anything. It's just a good song, a good rousing tune most of the time. And uh, it's just some, some it's, it's all based on dance music. That's the thing about the Viennese. It, 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 uh, it's lively, it's melodic, it tends to be one, two, three, one, two, three, in the, the, the waltz tradition, unless it's a polka, of course, in which case it's boom, tick, 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 tick. So if you like that kind of stuff, there's a good amount of that in here.